shall I come to play, baby? How shall I come around to see you one day? Shall I try to find a way to run away and get away someday? Gonna come someday, baby. Gonna fly around the world to hear you say. Gonna fly around the world to try and find you again and say. I never thought I'd see you again. I never thought I'd get to be with my best friend. I never thought I'd have to tell you again. Never thought I'd have to tell you I lost my mind again. The other one. <laughs> Alright, I got it over here. <laughs> I'm unfortunately I just recorded that comment. <laughs> you too. So, <laughs> this is the wonderful Emily Hohen and I'm Mick Davey hey. on assignment for National Geographic and we are about 89 meters up a tree, a giant eucalyptus regnans in the uh, upper Florentine Valley in Tasmania. The tree across the way is being mapped and climbed by a team of American arborists and they look so tiny, so humble as they clamber through those branches. And it's kind of terrifying because we also are just these tiny little things. You're on oh. 77 there. 77. How far can we see? I can see it to 80. Yeah, it's probably about four meters beyond that. Yeah. Can you see the mountains away behind you? Miles away, the really steep ones. That is big ones. And the rivers, and the other trees, the young ones and the old ones. Okay, now for azimuth, for branches, what we try, we're trying to model where most of the leaves are, yep. like a centroid of a cloud. Yep. So I'll take the azimuth from that node out to kind of the centroid, which would be roughly... Yeah. 23. You're kidding, right? You should be alright. You can't go that far wrong, can it? Which side does the up part come out of? Sure, you're totally kidding, right? No, honestly, I'd never use this, so. Yeah.
I feel like going and getting uh, some junk food and then watching a movie. Okay. Yeah, what do you reckon? Good. Yep. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? Get down like that.